Hey guys, what is going on? Nathan here and welcome back to a lovely world of Mario Craft. Hold on, I'm just going to set the scene. Oh, lovely. You're what you're wondering a bit if you watch the series, our house is over that way. You can see the house. Well, what are we doing on this lovely trying to give away tropical island? What I have surprised for you guys today just behind me is the um oh, <laughs> is the rare and exquisite lucky block and I think for more Mario Craft die fans it represents one of the blocks you jump up and you um, get an item. And I had this idea because I w actually I've always knew this kind of mod for a while, but I never decided to watch a video. And um, I kind of thought, you know, maybe I think it'd be really cool if I could put this into my, you know, just add it into my Minecraft series because you know not only does it resemble Mario, it's be a bit of fun. So this is why I made a promise, and I promise to you guys, and I will show you over there. You can't really see it much more because my render distance, but I have placed. You can actually make them out. Two lucky blocks over there. One is a very unlucky one. It's a minus 80 luck, which means the chances are that something bad. Basically, you don't know what this is. Basically, a lucky block is you mine it or by hand, and either something good, very good, or bad, or very bad happens. So you could either break it and you'll probably be trapped somewhere, or or um, you break it and you get loads of diamonds or diamonds tools or something. So um, yeah, for this, I kind of thought it'd be really good. I think near the, when we when we eventually finish this series. Um, I'm going to be mining both of those two blocks. It's more of just kind of thing that's nice to think. It'd be fun to see what happens because, um, you know, some things can actually really wreck your world up. So, you know, I know I could place it far away, but I thought, you know, I can't even remember. One of these is very good, one of these is very bad, and I thought it'd be really fun right at the end just to do this because um, we will break that block over there. I'm just empty my inventory. Um, I think it'd be very cool if we did this kind of at the end just to see, you know, it's one of those like risks things. Like, would if we had done it, would we have got maybe loads of diamonds, which would have helped us? Or would we have done it and the bad one and it would have probably done TNT you know so I think it'd be a bit of fun so um, at the moment I am just gonna empty my inventory in case I get trapped or something so I'm, I have I played around with it a bit just to see kind of what things it was like and it's a very fun mod so um, episode 12 anyway today guys um, I'll say the plan of action plan action step oh my God. step one or kind of action one what we're gonna do today is what we're gonna mine the block over there I should have re-empty my inventory before and we're gonna see what we get you know, be a, I hope maybe the sign hopefully will stay there. Maybe it gets destroyed. Sorry about all that. I was like, never. Right. I did this. I did do this in creative, but it was just because it's more of a little startup. So you know, don't. Of course, this is this island of sand is really going to help us, isn't it? But anyway, I'll talk about more. Here we go, guys. Our first lucky block on Mario Craft. Oh, well, oh, and also we've been loyal to Mario. We wore a skin, and recently we've got an upgraded HD skin. So that just looks sexy. So here we go. Give us diamonds. Give us diamonds. Oh. And we oh we get a diamond chest player. <laughs> oh that is awesome. <laughs> well that that's a good start, isn't it? It looks now now <laughs> we're bulky Mario. <laughs> I actually was wondering, it's like, is that what you're gonna give us some leather armor? But no, that's is diamond chest player. I'm happy with that. I'm not gonna argue. I'm not gonna like redo it just because I think it's something good. Because that's you know it's a diamond chest plate that costs I think eight diamonds. So yeah, that's that's a really good kind of find. Now help us against the mobs and of course the curse of dry bones. Now this island has possessed us with, but good news is I've been playing. I've been playing this map a bit offhand. You know, we've got some. I've been doing some chickens because I, w I need them for what I'm about to do today. And I've got a lot more cows or the prostitute cows due to the open mouths. Um, hold on, I started this at quarter past. We'll say so. Okay, that's fine. Um, uh, last episode I did say we we're going to get to there, but we are going to do that now. I just wanted to do that kind of start up. But yeah, um, I hope I didn't accidentally press it because these blocks are very delicate. So imagine if I mine one of these and TNT comes out and this series is <laughs> ruined already but I just thought it'd be fun and I did load this world up well it's been loaded up previously so I'm not sure they still like you know if a new world spawns them in you know so I doubt we'll find any anyway naturally because they're very I think they're 1 and 200 chunks but yeah I'm not focusing on that at all it's just more of a fun thing and especially near the end to see what we get so anyway that, that is the curse if the curse continues I know that is the source of it the bow that dropped from one of the dry bones but anyway we're going to get some blade threads now because we, we, we want to wrap the, you know we're not we're still quite young, middle into it, but we're not gonna, you know, we want to win this game, don't we? We want to beat this game, so we're going to need our metal hammer, whatever that's gone. Um, an iron pickaxe, so we need one of them. Um, I don't think I need any torch to lit the path up, so I'll, I'll take eight. Food, of course, we need food, mushrooms, perfect. 
Um, don't need bone meal. I think that's all I need, really. Just that. I think I'll make one more. Have I got these smelted yet? Oh, yes. Oh, look at that. Another, apparently, we've just got that achievement again, even though we earned it ages ago. But, okay. And we got some gold. Oh, yeah, because I, oh, no. yeah, I can also make blocks. Um, look at this. Maybe we can maybe just do one now, cheekily. Maybe, well, maybe we'll do one in the nether. To make one, because the new update, basically, originally, to make one, um, hold with me here. You make a dropper, which a dropper is here. One piece of redstone. Nope. Okay, a dropper. Sorry about that, people. My phone, my ringtone, very classy. And then we put the dropper there. I don't think I have enough gold, but then I think we... Oh, no, we need a bit more gold, because it goes round. But then once you get that, the f cool thing they've added is, the whole point about luck blocks and bad bad luck blocks, that's really hard to pronounce, is um, you can, like, if I had diamonds and some emeralds, I could kind of put that original block in, and um, put that original block in, add some diamonds and emeralds around the side, and it increases the luck. So for survival purposes, it could be very useful, I, I, I personally believe. But yeah, I'm not going to focus priority on that, because I, you know, I don't want to, for example, get loads of diamond armor, like, and like, or pick tools from it, I don't want to cheat as such, so... Anyway, let's focus on the objective. I don't want to waste too much time talking, but I kind of have already, but I think hopefully it's been alright for you guys. Um, yeah, so I'm just making another sword. That's all I need, and I'll just deposit the rest. Um, I will talk about now something useful about the series, though, about especially what we're doing. Um, I'm probably going to... I said, I want to get at least the blaze rods done today and get at least a good good amount and stuff like that. I want to make things I know I want to do, which I'll probably be doing wherever all I decide. I want to upgrade the house and make it bigger. I know like, you don't really need a bigger house, but personally for me, I'd like you know, different rooms, a bedroom, a chest room, like that. I want to build an enchanting table. I need to get some sugar cane to make bookshelves, of course. Hopefully we don't die. Last time there was a wither skeleton, I believe. Yeah, here's the way. Um, yes, I want to get inside your tools, because of course we need them for the wither, uh, the, the wither dragon. <laughs> the ender dragon. Imagine a wither dragon. That'd be uh, nasty. Um, okay, some fire. And yeah, I think... And that's the main things I want to do, like, I want to get out of the way, but I also need to find some more ores, so... Let's go, anyway, we've got our diamond chest player, I hope I don't kind of wreck it all on this one thing. I actually completely forgot about armor. These are zombie pigmen, so these shouldn't attack us, as long as I don't get too close to them. I haven't got my volume on, so I really hope none of them do attack me. I have put some torches on the spawner, so hopefully we don't get... Yep, yeah, hopefully we don't get a surprise attack. Oh my god. Sorry guys, I'm, I'm just too popular sometimes. I really am. I, I'm, I'm trying to stop it, but I, it's too hard. <laughs> but yeah, I'm really, really excited about starting my new series up. I, I, I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing yet, but I've got some good ideas. So I really kind of want to wrap these up. Not such that I'm brushing them, but I will still put the same time in you know, editing them. But I really kind of... Oh, oh, oh. Don't get on fire, don't get on fire. Oh, we got... Okay. So I don't want to make it... If that was quick, because it spawned, even though there was torches. So I don't want loads spawning out. So I'll take the main torch off. I'm looking for some blaze rods though. In our bulky suit we should be alright, so maybe I'll take another torch off and maybe this torch off. Oh. And we'll see how this goes, I'll just stand back. Oh my shit, oh my shitty. <gasps> Why is, okay hold on. Hold on, I did that wrong. That was something I was meant to put on. Um, just in case of that happening, um, see my programming game rule keep then there's a capital here keep in inventory true and my battery's low now th th this is really working out Ugh. keep him dry I swear I swear that's what it was um game rule keep inventory true one more time Game rule, maybe it's a capital, keep inventory true. It's probably like I'm doing something completely wrong or different, but oh well, okay. Uh, we'll stand up here again and put it back on easy. So things like that, but I, I don't want to die, you see people. He just put me on fire. We've got a blaze rod though. Oh my god, it's awesome. It's like, um, eat a mushroom. Just Oh, I thought I could eat these. Oops. Oh, it's like one of those things you used to get at the end of Super Mario Bros. 3. I've been watching a lot of Mario videos and playing a lot of Mario recently, actually, so I'm really in the mood at the moment. Yeah, because recently I finished. Oh, that was. I recently finished. I should really bought bucket. Oh no, because it dissolves, doesn't it? Yeah, I, I recently finished Super Mario Bros. Three, uh, Super Mario Galaxy Two, and I'm on the Green Stars at the moment. I, I, it's quite fun doing the Green Stars because they're more of a challenge. But yeah, I'm doing that currently. Well, 
I go for the green stuff. I'm not saying I'm recording that at the moment, but you know, it's been quite fun doing it. Just step down a bit and then step back up. Um, what else have I been doing? I've been watching a lot of Mario videos and top 10 games and stuff. And I think Super Mario Bros. 3, you guys, hope, comment what you guys think. What is the best? What do you think the best or the funnest Super Mario Bros. game you played? Because personally, for me, I'd always. Oh, okay, we've got another one. That face is perfect. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me. Yes, another blade shot. I try to keep it in under control, so it may be a bit slow, but it's important. And yeah, I, I definitely get recommend. Uh, well, I definitely recommend to anyone if they asked for a good game to get into Mario is Super Mario Bros. 3. Although you could probably classify it being one of the hard, hardest kind of. I'd say one of the hardest games overall. Not because all these like Super Mario Bros. World, you know, these are only levels. Most of the other games are quite swift, but Super Mario Bros. 3 is quite a challenge for even World 1, especially I find just the controls and stuff. But well, not controls, I guess you could say. Oh, don't don't be a dick. Don't be a dick. Come on, come down. Oh. Four blades rods, yes. <gasps> come on, come over here, bud. You can't shoot me through wood. We'll never rack. So you might as well come over here, okay? Well, I'll go get it then. Place a torch there so that it shouldn't be able to spawn. Oh, whoa, this, this guy, this guy. Oh my god, is that another spawn over there? Was burnt to a crisp while fighting. Blaze. <sighs> now I'm gonna get creeped on, won't I? That's a nice moon. I, <laughs> I had a chance to play. I had my levels, which I was spent. I was waiting to spend and everything, and I've lost it. And all oh, because there's some shitty blazers. You're OP because I can fly with fire, which doesn't make sense. They <sighs> they can like put you on fire. And everything. Bullshit. I've lost my levels and because the stupid programming requires exact key programming. I'm like I probably was like one capital letter a word of. Game rule, keep inventory true. <laughs> and my stuff's burnt. <laughs> oh I'm annoyed. Look at my XP dropping to the ground. It's disappointed in me. At least if I can get all my stuff. How's my diamond chest? My diamond chest bit's still doing quite well. That's alright. We got our blaze rods. Okay, we've got everything, so that's alright. So F you blaze. Yeah, I swear, is that a spawn over there though? That is another spawner. We found two blaze. Sorry, but this is probably I know first of all, it's some some people they find it hard to find a uh, well it's not saying they find it because it's where they spawn it. It's hard to find a Neville Fortress. Second of all, it's hard to actually find the um Oh shit. Get down. Get down! What gives you the right to fly? Give me that blaze rod as well. Yeah, second of all, actually, ooh, actually trying to find the um, blaze fortress, you know, spawner, is another hard thing. Okay, I should really put a torch on now. I should really put a torch on. Um, yeah, trying to find the blaze spawner. So, yeah, I haven't found any uh, never war or whatever it be called in Mario terms. I really wouldn't know, but no, I think we're doing all right. Just make sure I put everything out. I've got, I've got five blaze rods, and I think I might, I probably will stop. What? Well, I'm coming to 15 minutes anyway, so I probably will. Oh, I'm 13. I'll probably stop. Maybe I can get one more blaze because there we go. This gives us something. We'll stop. There we go. I'll stop now. Just for the fact, really, you know, it's all good having blaze rods, but you know that we know there's a spawner here. But at the end of the day, I need Enderman. That'd be harder to get, find, and actually kill and get Ender Eye, uh, Ender Pearl, Ender, Ender Eyes. Yeah. Oh, okay. And another one still spawns. Okay. Uh, but yeah, we are level eight. Oh my god, I'm I'm, I'm doing amazing here. Okay, I might as well take this one on as well. Ho <laughs> ho! Yeah, definitely good for levels. Okay, that's enough. I gotta get too tempting to kill them. Oh, another one spawn. This is just asking for it now. Ooh. He wants me to hit the zombie pig. No, god, oh, I'm near death. I'm near death. Don't. No! No! Fuck! Oh my god! I'm sorry. Oh, there's dry oh, Drybones is watching me. Drybones is watching me. Let me in, let me in. Oh my god. Oh my god, come on! He was literally like, you ain't fucking run away, bitch. I'm gonna <laughs> Why me? Oh my god. Oh! Dang it. There's a boo. 
Oh my god. Look at that, guys. That's pretty awesome. But no, yeah, that is just unlike. It's just, I was actually. I don't know why my game is still playing when I'm paused. That's kind of. I don't like it, things like that. And I was actually hoping, please don't just be that new. Uh, that dick and fire fireball, even though you're out of my range. And he has to do that. Doesn't he? And that's like lowered all my motivation now. <laughs> but let's just get this done anyway. Um, in the next episode, however, people. Oh. We will be. We got never. We will. Oh, where the hell am I? We will be making an obsidian ta an enchantment table. I'll probably be. I'll probably try to find some sugarcane beforehand because I don't want to like waste this with searching. But I definitely will be um, making an enchantment table, planting sugarcane. Hold on, let me just make sure I got everything. I've got my diamond chest plate, which is what I need. I'm missing a metal hammer, but I may have broke that. And I'm missing a pickaxe. That's the pickaxe. Okay, I'm fine with the power. I'm leaving them alone. God, they spawn even with loads of torches. See, whew, they're really asking for it. Oh, there's my sword. Okay, good. That's alright. I'm not gonna put it on peaceful though, because that's cheating. So, but yeah, uh, I will be doing that. You know, hopefully making bookshelves to get the levels up a bit. So at least I can have some enchanting armor now to help me with mobs like that, because that's definitely annoying me. Um, and then really, I guess when I think about it. After I've done that, it's just really Enderman, so maybe we'll, we'll go on the hunt for Enderman. Because I think, I, I think about, I think I'd rather base this series on more kind of getting to the end, completing objectives, rather than, like, you know, like Syndicate, for example, his mind, I think he's still doing it about mods now, or whatever, but, you know, he's um, done a lot of episodes, and it's based on, like, not stuff you don't need, but, like, exploring the whole of Minecraft. I think mean, I'd rather, especially on this, because some more of other series, focus on, you know, just getting to the end as best as I can, so. Anyway, guys, hopefully we don't get creeped on now, we want to get safety back in our house. Look at that. It's freaky as though. They're paroling me. They are patrolling me. But yeah, guys. Like, uh, smash the like. Oh, sh okay, yeah, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.